over and I wanted to give my reaction to what I just seen last night, which is which was crazy. I saw a lot of stuff and all I have to say is great wrestling, but bad endings. That's all I have to say about that. Um, there was a lot of stuff that went wrong. Uh, obviously, Reigns getting booed at the stadium. <laughs> That's a given right there. Uh, Enzo being injured. I'm glad he's all right. I'm so glad that he's, you know, he's fine. And um, we had another screw job <laughs> involving Bret Hart, but not involving Bret Hart because Bret Hart was there. Uh, so Chicago screw job, <laughs> which is really a middle finger to Bret for being there to support Natalia which was terrible like I said before great wrestling just bad endings and uh, Sa Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens okay that was in my opinion match of the night that was match of the night they had a great storyline building up to it and it went well it, it really went well you could see that these guys hate each other the storyline it it makes sense and the build-up just made it that much more interesting uh let's see what else uh Kalisto and Ryback for the pre-show which I don't understand why it was on the pre-show and not on the actual show because that's a title match I mean I I would have put like <laughs> a match nobody cares about on the, the pre-show like, but whatever. Uh, Shane McMahon and Stephanie McMahon actually having to share control, which is dumb. That's the most stupidest thing I've ever seen. You could have did the brand split. Vince, but Vince is so crazy. He's like, I want blood. My own children, I want blood. I want you to fight over it. They got to fight over Raw. You could have gave Stephanie McMahon SmackDown. You could have gave Shane Raw. Shane's been doing an amazing job with Raw. And you can't say that he hasn't. Because the people love it. The people want him to have control. And then here comes Stephanie. What has Stephanie done to say, hey, I deserve control? Uh, but anyway, it was, anyway <laughs> that's just crazy. But yeah, I would have had it. SmackDown versus Raw, once again. It's been a while since we had the brand split again. And I, I thought that was, it, that was definitely a missed opportunity by WWE, uh, I gotta say. And um, Roman, went, Roman Reigns versus AJ. Uh, again, Roman winning. I think a lot of people assumed that outcome uh, I don't. I don't think they. <laughs> they didn't assume all the re the restarts. I think it got restarted like t twice. I thought it was gonna be restarted like three times. But wow. <laughs> I was kind of hope. Uh, I mean, if you're gonna restart something, restart that Natalia match. How about that? I was gonna. I would restart that. Uh, let's see, Ryback and Kaliso actually had a great match. Uh, the Gorilla Press off the top rope, I don't think anybody's ever done that. Which is insane. <laughs> uh, Ambrose and Chris Jericho also had a great match. Um, uh, like I said, great matches. Great matches. Great wrestling. Which is what we want to see. Great wrestling. But the endings just didn't some of the ending just didn't go right i to be honest i give this i give the payback um i mean i i give it a b minus i i would give it a b minus just just because of the great wrestling that we saw and again enzo i know enzo got injured last night and um they'll probably do the the tag team finals uh, tonight on Monday Night Raw, it, it probably will. But anyway, um, let me uh, 
Let me know what you guys thought. Let me know what you guys thought of WWE Payback. Was there something I missed? Um, maybe, maybe you saw something that I didn't notice. But um, I'd like to know your reaction and tell me how you all thought. And if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. If you didn't, then <laughs> hit the like button, subscribe, and share <laughs> because you know you want to. But anyway, uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.